Hey, this is Caio. And this is Mike. From EssentialDeveloper.com Okay, we are about to start tomato number 11, but I think it's time for us to start drawing some diagrams. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Get an overview of things and see what we've done so far and architecture. We started with the engine module in isolation in its own project and we have the flow and a router protocol that's going to be implemented outside that module. Mm -hmm. So we are inverting the dependency. If we make the flow communicates directly to an implementation of a routing that lives outside the project, it means that we depend on that and we don't want this. So we add a protocol that lives in that engine project and someone outside is going to implement it. That's the dependency inversion. Yep, exactly. But we don't have an implementation yet, so it's empty. We need to create something here. We also lack a presenter that can translate the game modules to presentable answers. So this presentation layer is going to be a map layer from the game modules that we don't have yet. Well, they are strings so far. Mm -hmm. To presentable answers that is going to be rendered by the UI layer. So as you see, the presentation layer doesn't have any dependency on the UI. The UI depends on the presentation. And I don't want my presentation depending on the routing layer as well. So when we want to have separations of layers, we need to think who's going to create the objects and inject dependencies. Because we have protocols and someone's going to implement it. And you need to inject those dependencies in the right modules. And what glues everything together is the main module. The main module. We can use factories, we can use assemblers. And where should they live? They should live in the main. Exactly. Under the horizontal line. Exactly. We're going to have protocols for factories or assemblers or any kind of mechanism for breaking down the dependencies. And the implementations live in main. So we can have a main for iPhone that tie things in a different way than from iPad. Or we can have an implementation for the tvOS that use maybe the same presentation layer but a different routing style. Exactly. It's like Lego blocks, right? The engine stay as it is and we can just break down the layers depending on the platform and our needs. Exactly. Everything's offline right now. And I like that. It's easy to test. And at some point, we're going to need a service layer in between here. It's too soon yet, but if everything's separated, it would be very easy to just plug in a service layer in here. And that's it. I quite like how it looks so far. So I think we should leave the UI for now, go back to the engine and have a look if everything's fine for us to create the routing. Okay. Or routing. Or routing. <laughs> okay, let's do it.